Hello once again Wildcats and welcome to our first edition of the Wildcat Profile. My name is Paul Roper, joined by one of the members of the Davidson Moving Company. He's senior offensive lineman Malik McDaniel, native of just outside of Memphis, Tennessee. Malik, first of all, welcome. And let's start by your journey at Davidson. When you were getting recruited out of high school, what was it that drew you to Davidson College? Yeah, so there are a lot of things that um, drew me here. First off was I was being recruited by Coach Berlin. And um, him, just his persistency and, and wanting me to be here was just a big part of it. Also, we all know about Davidson's academics. Um, mm -hmm. That was just a big part of me choosing a college. And so those two things combined made Davidson a really good choice. Now that you've been here going into your fourth season at Davidson, what have you enjoyed being a Wildcat? Or what have you enjoyed the most, I should say, about being a Wildcat? Yeah, a couple things. I, I think something that's kind of changed for me since being here at school it's just the brotherhood and, and being a part of this team. Um, it's just honestly been the best part about being here. Mm -hmm. I also think um, the coaching staff and just being at this place um, of great academics and great athletics, um, it's just been a great, great three years and it's going to be a great fourth year. And speaking of change, uh, you're making history because this is the first player profile that's done in the Sheridan yeah. Brothers locker room, one of the many great facilities here at the Game Changers Fieldhouse in Davidson College Stadium. Uh, how have you enjoyed these new facilities? Oh, yeah, it's been this fall camp in particular, but really the last couple of months, um, the feel and these new facilities has just been so different um, from our locker room to our weight room um, to the on-field experience. Um, and even for me, being an old lineman, the new nutrition area that we have, <laughs> um, the feel of just being in here, it's just added a lot of excitement to it. Now, what, now what do you get from the nutrition area? Uh, there's a lot of things, but, you know, those Welch's fruit snacks are probably my favorite <laughs> thing. Um, but also there's some good protein shakes in there, you know. So. Well, that's excellent. Well, other than protein shakes and Welch's fruit snacks, what do you like to eat outside of the locker room? Ah, it's a hard choice, but, you know, got to go with that good old steak. Uh, really like a ribeye, not too much fat on it, cooked medium. But, yeah, steak's probably my go-to meal. I prefer a New York strip medium. So that's, yeah. I think if we ever go to that steakhouse together, I know what to get you. So when you you, you also do a lot of work in the community. You were mm. part of the All-State Good Works team last year as Davidson's nominee. What are some of the things that you do for our community here at Davidson's? Yeah, so um, here being at Davidson, I'm a Bonner Scholar, and so we pride, our, pride ourselves on community service. And so – I do a lot of couple, a lot of things. Um, one thing I do is I tutor at the community school of Davidson right down mm -hmm. the road. And so I help out with math, a um, couple different math classes. Also, I'm a part of an organization called Young Life. And so I get to mentor and, and be a part of um, high schoolers' lives and their uh, journeys going through um, high school. And so, um, yeah, I've just learned that doing those things, it is, it's really for other people, but I find so much joy and fulfillment from doing those things. Now, outside of Davidson, where is a place that you'd most like to travel to? I think, I mean, I would just go with Hawaii, I guess. I mean, <laughs> I think that would be a good place, but yeah. Hawaii is a great place. Yeah, yeah. Uh, it's certainly, it's always sunny. You've got those great beaches. And uh, when you come to campus every day and you see your teammates, I mean, how much have you enjoyed the brotherhood here? I mean, what are some of the things that make you happy to, to be part of this football team? Yeah. I think kind of like how I said earlier, but just being a senior and being a captain on the football team, I think my perspectives have kind of changed, um, mm -hmm. not really focusing on myself, but trying to focus on the younger guys and, you know, the guys I'm playing beside and then thinking about the offense and then the whole team in general. But it's just cool because we get to walk through life and kind of experience football and school um, at the same time, like at this unique place. And so, it's just the older I've gotten, the more that I've realized how much of a blessing it is to be here. Now, I always know that ping pong games are always a big thing in locker rooms. And you told me before we started taping that you enjoy pickleball. Yes. How did that start? Yes. So I actually, on a Young Life uh, leader trip, I was in Columbia, South Carolina, and they said they were going to play pickleball. And I was like, I don't want to play no pickleball. That sounds so lame. But I, <laughs> I went with them. And so um, I was just sitting there, and I was like, why not play? So I ended up playing. And uh, since then, I've the summer playing seven times a week. Started a pickleball Instagram. You know, it's pretty, pretty big time on pickleball. But yeah, 
Oh, that's awesome. Well, Malik, thank you for joining us for this week's edition of the Wildcat Profile. Best of luck this season. Congratulations on being named the team captain. Yes, sir. Thank you so much. He's Malik McDaniel. I'm Paul Roper. That does it for our first edition of the Wildcat Profile. We'll see you next time.